What's up everybody? Welcome back to Wild and Wonderful Adventures. I thought about this idea over the weekend and I wanted to find out how many sheets of paper my 40 cal could shoot through. Uh, I roughly have about 2,000 sheets of paper, maybe a little more. Um, we'll see how much penetration we have with this firearm. Um, if it doesn't get the job done, I'll grab another one and we'll have at it with that. Uh, if you guys know how many sheets of paper it's going to shoot through, comment below before we start and let us know what you think. Also, make sure you like this video, comment, and subscribe to our channel. What's up, everybody? We're about to get this video started. First off, I wanted to show you what I'm shooting today, um, show you the paper so you guys have an idea of what's going on. So first off, this here is the pistol. This is a XD Mod 2. It's made by Springfield Armory. And we're shooting just full metal jacket bullets. And also, right here is the paper we're shooting. As you can see, there's 500 sheets in each one of these. I'm going to start out shooting one. Uh, we'll see if it goes through that. I'll try to shoot it uh, somewhere closer to an edge. Um, that way, I could continue to reuse that. Paper. All right, guys. We're getting this started. I got my handy dandy pistol. We got some paper sitting down there ready to be shot. Let's see what happens. Hopefully I don't shoot my GoPro. You guys know I suck at shooting. All right. All right, guys, it looks like I actually hit that one dead center. I will show you guys what it looks like. I'm almost positive it went straight through it. Let's take a look at this. All right, this is crazy. This is crazy. So this is just one pack of paper and it actually stopped it. Look guys, look right here. It went in here and you could actually see the bullet inside of there. Nothing through the back. <laughs> this is my new body armor, guys. <laughs> my new body armor. I'm just gonna walk around with paper on my chest. <laughs> All right, we're gonna try this again. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put another shot through that and uh, see if it was just a fluke or if paper really stops a bullet. All right, so I've got the paper set up again. We're gonna send another shot from the 40 cal down there. Uh, see if we could actually get it to go through this paper. If it doesn't go through on this shot, I'm gonna go get a bigger gun. Um, really surprised that didn't go through. We'll see what happens. It looked like a pretty good hit. Uh, let me clear this gun and then we'll go down there and check it out. Guys, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this could be your new body armor. Look, in nothing out it's a little bulged up copy paper it stops bullets this is bulletproof guys i'd say see if we can find a bullet in there look at that it stopped right in there somewhere We'll be back right after this commercial break. All right, looks like we found the bullet right here. Check that out. That is crazy. That, it didn't even go through half of it. This is right here is where we found it. Full stack, right there. I think the other one's right down in here. That one may have went through a little more. Yeah, there's all kinds of fragments in there as you guys can see. All right, well, I'll tell you what, guys. We are going to go grab a bigger gun, um, and we're going to get through this paper today. We'll be right back. All right, I went and got my 12-gauge. Uh, this is a Sportsman Auto. I'm going to shoot a one-ounce slug into that, and we're going to see if it penetrates at all. 
hopefully. And uh, to be honest, I'm a little nervous to shoot this gun. Um, I am shooting a slug and I haven't shot one in a while. So we'll see. Twelve gauge slug. We'll see if this goes through. <laughs> that was awesome. Uh, we're gonna go down here, check this out, see if it actually penetrated all the way through or if it just blew it up. This is the aftermath after a one ounce slug. Check that out. It actually caught the wad on the back side. So with that being said, this paper did not stop a one ounce slug. I'm actually gonna set up two. We'll set up uh, two boxes of this, uh, see if it stops two. All right. All right, guys, I got two packs of paper sitting down there now. That's 1,000 sheets of paper. I have another one ounce slug. Um, we're gonna see if this goes through both packages of paper. I'd say more than likely it went through both packages of paper. All right, guys. So I'm not sure if this is the first pack or the second pack, but I can see you through that hole. <laughs> look at that. That's the back side. That's the front side. Well, look, we have a piece of the wad there or a piece of the plastic. <laughs> so this one may be the second one. Maybe it's the first one. I don't know. <laughs> The second pack is back here. Looks like it went clean through. Uh, there's also more down here. Clean through. There's a hole through and through all of it. Uh, I got some more paper, guys. We're gonna shoot it. All right, I got everything set up again. I wanted to bring out the AR-15, show you guys that gun. That is my favorite gun out of my whole collection. And you guys get the honor to see that today. So with that being said, I've actually put almost all the paper that I have right here. So like I said earlier, roughly 2000 sheets, minus a few spread around in this area. But we're gonna shoot this and we'll see what the 223 does. All right guys, here is my AR-15. Uh, it is a DPMS. Uh, it is chambered in 556 or 223. This right here is what I've, I'm going to shoot. This is a 5.56 green tip. I'm going to shoot this one first. And then after this one, we will shoot a tracer just to see if we could catch some paper on fire. But uh, we're going to see how many pieces this will go through. And by the way, this gun is not sighted in. I just took the scope off. So hopefully I can still hit the paper, but we'll see what happens. Fire in the two, two, three. That even hit it. <laughs> I think we hit it that time, guys. <laughs> All right, guys. So came down here and actually both of the bullets hit. Um, I guess it was moving so fast to just cut straight through it. But if you guys come down here and take a look at this, right there was one hole. There's the other one. Uh, exit. And then it went through both here, through all that. Uh, we had that laying down. Uh, looks like both holes in this one. I'm not really sure if that one has an exit hole or not. Oh, we got two holes in that one. And I don't know about this one. I don't see one in this one. Do you see one? No. My camera woman back there, she doesn't <laughs> see my <laughs> bullet holes. See if you can find the bullet. All right, so I'm gonna attempt to, yeah. we can see if we can see the bullet down here anywhere. But I think it went clean through all of it. There's a piece of that. Yeah. Nope. 
I don't see it anywhere right now. Uh, I'm going to set all this up. I'm going to shoot it with a tracer. Uh, we'll see if we catch this paper on fire. All right. All right. We're back again. This time we are shooting a tracer. I want to see if this paper will catch on fire. I think it'll be super cool if it does. So let's see what happens. No fire. Ah, well, that kind of sucks. But hey, that's our video, guys. We're checking this out. We just shot it with the tracer. If you look right here, our bullet went in here. You can see that little hole there. Came through the backside. Went through this one. Went through that one. Let's see if it came through the back, guys. It, it does not look like the bullet came through the back unless it went through here. And maybe it went through here, kind of looks like it tore everything up right there. So it may have went through here and then just kind of skimmed off the top of the last one. I've got all the paper set back up. I'm just gonna blow it up with this 12 gauge. I've got two slugs left, one ounce slugs. I think you guys seen these earlier. So I'm gonna shoot it the first time. It's probably gonna fall off. I'm gonna shoot it again, just because I wanna shoot them. All right. All right, I know you guys just seen that. I blew the earth halfway up with that 12 gauge. Uh, the massive crater in the ground is freaking awesome. Let's check this out. So our second bullet landed right here. It looks like a asteroid came and wrecked the earth. I was hoping, well, oh guys, come here, I found a bullet. Oh, look at that. Look at that there. Oh, check that out. That right there is a one ounce slug. How cool is that, guys? Also, look at that. That's like a piece of the water or something. Our paper's obliterated. Like this video, subscribe, comment, voila.